today I'm going to show you how to write the code in to the assembly language first of all I want to show you software you need the DOS box and some compiler these both softwares are free and uh, I just extract here this archive file all the files are here Okay, let's start first program. Okay, first of all, you must have a bracket open O or G. So zero X zero one double zero. And now at the end it should be a int 0 x to 1 okay this is your header and footer inside you have to write the code code is a x okay I'm going to put a value value 5 into a a x now AX is not a variable like in C C with we assign a value into variable. AX is a register. It's a register AX, BX, CX, DX. These four registers are a, the number of register. Uh, now BX ten. Now BX is your uh, your destination and ten is a constant source. So value 10 will go into a BX register. Now uh, I'm going to add those two registers value. And the BX value as a 10, AX 5. So AX will be 15. Okay. That's all your code. And make sure there should not be any space save as I'm going to do a name test one dot ASM test one dot ASM save it so there is this text file here and this is assembler source okay now just open this DOS box here you have to first mount your uh, that uh, your directory m o u n t mount let's say m colon C colon forward slash AWS EMB LY so assembly drive M is mountain M enter now you are in a dismounted director here we need to create a output file the exe file and a list file how to do this NASM NASM space that file name that we want to compile test one dot asm this is our file okay now just create the output file minus o output test one dot com this is our exe file space minus l L stand for list minus L test one dot LST LST is a list file press enter good now here you see test one dot com is a exe file and test one dot list is a list file okay I'm going to run this test com file to run that file I need to write a 
afd space test one dot com enter okay now there is this value you can see here move ax triple zero five now this value is not uh, in a decimal this is a in a hex uh, just turn calculator into a program programmer and okay now the hex value what is x value triple zero five on the mm -hmm. okay why not can't believe open why okay here we go Oh, actually, so you know, before a digit zero is nothing, therefore, I can't type a zero here. Actually, the five is a decimal five, so that is the right value. And uh, if I press F1 to go to a next step, now if I press F1, this is a, uh, and you will see here now AX00, zero zero, and uh, actually. You can see it's on this line, but it's not yet executed. You must have to press F1. You must pass that. So here you see AX is still 005. It means it's a decimal 5. BX is a triple zero A. So as you know, A stands for 15 in a hex. If I type A, A is a, no, sorry, A is a 10, decimal 10. Uh, because we moved ax 10 into a ax register we move the value 10 okay go further now you see now it's a execute this line ax bx so bx had the 10 and ax had the 5 so it is the 15 now so before ax was 5 now ax is equal to f now what is f f is 15 so yeah the, our result is fine press f1 it will just go to end and it will start again from the beginning okay and there was a main important thing in the beginning it's it doesn't compile because if you have a space here or or you start from here somewhere like this it, it doesn't like if there is a spaces then you cannot compile this file so when you start a new file it should start from the top and there should not any space when you start this program writing the code there and yeah thank you very much for watching this video